Welcome to day 7 of the series How to go from where you are to where you want to be. I am going to invite you to my home for dinner and I have done 10 favorite foods of yours and let's say that you are a foodie and you are very hungry. You see all those 10 dishes that you love, you really want to have it, you sit on a chair, you are about to have it but then I will put a condition. You, ha you have to have all 10 dishes at once. Mm -hmm. Swallow it and say, ha, ah, food was very good. I want you to tell that. But do you think it's possible? At least human beings can't have everything at once. They can have only bite by bite. Correct. Same logic for our goals. I've seen so many people who wants to start business. After six months, hey, nobody's buying my product, man. Nobody wants my service. I don't think this business is suitable for me. They'll come to conclusion after six months or one year. Why? Because they wouldn't have set their milestones. That is the topic of this video, today's video. You must set your milestones for your goals. For example, if you ask me, I want to lose 14 kgs of weight in the next 9 months. 2 kgs approximately in a month. Okay, which means I need 7 months. I have kept extra 2 months because I have so many other goals. So, I mean, I have 3 goals, 3 major goals for this year. Okay, so this is one of my major goals. So I can dedicate 5 days in a week to exercise, 5 days in a week to eat the right kind of food. Good enough, right? So that is why I've kept a buffer of 2 months. Every month, 2 kgs of weight I'll reduce and every week also I progress. See, this is how I have divided my milestones. What is a milestone for your goals? So taking that example, they wanted to start their own business. First of all, have they done enough research whether that business, what are the pros and cons? They wouldn't have done. Simply they would have called one person, hey man, I'm going to start this. Five minutes, they would have decided they want to start this business. That's a major pitfall. They wouldn't have researched how many competitors are there, how, is there any re real demand for this, right? And how do I approach people who have already achieved this goal? Because any goal that you take, there are so many people who have already achieved what you want to achieve. We are not inventors, right? See, if you are an inventor, that's a different story. Otherwise, we want to achieve goals where so many other people have already achieved. How do I approach such people? How do I find out that people? How do I network with this? I, how do I know uh, what are the mistakes that I should not do? So all these 50 hours of research you have to do first before jumping in. After that 50 hours of research, having that mindset of what to do, what not to do, at least on a very good level. Then if you start a business, then, okay, first, I have to buy this software. Okay, this is a competition. Now this is the investment required for this. And after that, these are the equipments that I need. Maybe I need to hire people uh, once I go to the stage. So these are the different stages of my business. Okay, and what kind of marketing campaigns that I should do. Can you see? Now they have set the milestones. Research, approach people, buy software, equipments. Once I go to the next level, I mean, how much of investment is required? Once I go to the next level, then how many people should I hire? What kind of talent should they have? These are the milestones. Now, after six months or one year, they would have been in a very good position because they have set milestones for the goals. So, day seven assignment for your friends. Set milestones for your goals. What is my first milestone? When I'm going to achieve it. What is my second milestone? When I'm going to achieve it. What is my third? And when I'm going to achieve it. Unless you have this breakup, you will not achieve your goal. Definitely not. Because you don't know whether you're progressing or not. If you don't know whether you're progressing or not, how will you even know that you will achieve your goals or not? Okay? So please set milestones for your goals. What is a milestone? And when are you going to achieve it? Okay? And please like this video because only if you like this video, this video reaches a lot of people. Because I've kept a goal that this series should reach at least 100,000 people. So without your support, definitely I can't achieve that goal. So please like this video and please subscribe to my channel because that is how I know such videos are helping you. And in the next one week, if you want to transform your life, watch this video.